inside. It's nice here, but you know what there isn't? Do you know what there isn't here? Microphones that work or any auto cue. Should we use all three? <laughs> well, we, can... we probably should. This looks nice. Yeah, um, right. It's been an amazing festival so far. We've had brilliant acts including Ellie Goulding, we've had Scissor Sisters, N Dubs, the XX Faithless, France the Machine. We've been sport for choice. Um, I'm going to move to this camera over here now. Is that all right? Can we do that? Look at that. Which is why we, we've invented a website and it is called iTunes Festival at ITV. Dot com because we want to know what's been your favourite bits. So email us, please. Or if you've got any questions or comments for our guest tonight, Martin Freeman or Ollie Murs, Ollie Murs, you can post them on our Twitter and Facebook pages and they could be answering your questions live on TV. Just head to itv.com forward slash ITV2 to find out how. Right, our next band have been one of the pioneers of the dance music scene for over 15 years. Their very first gig was just around the corner from here at the Jazz Cafe uh, back in 90... Sorry, I almost took you right then. Back in 19... <laughs> 96 in front of an audience of just 400 people. They've come a long way since then. Nearly a quarter of a million of you applied for tickets to see them when they, well, they took the roof off the place on Wednesday. I was lucky enough to meet them in person before they took to the stage. Here's Faithless. Oh, so at Maxi Jazz to be my best mate. I mean, my best mate in the whole world ever. Never like, just reshare. Never gonna everything. happen. Call now, me, Maxie, Amy call McDonald me. is Why playing are you live. So down on me? Just chill out, Dave. Relax. <laughs> if I want that man to be my. Relax. Uh, Amy McDonald is playing live inside in right now. But together. earlier this evening, another lovely young lady graced the stage. She's now finished her set, freshened up, and is out here with us on the terrace live. It's Tiffany Page. How, <laughs> how was your gig Thank earlier you. on? How was it? I uh, haven't had a chance to see her yet, but I'm um, looking forward to seeing her. Thank As you, you say, you, you play a legendary venue like the Roundhouse. Um, how do you go and celebrate afterwards? Oh, sometimes it, I go to sleep. Do you like to, to go sleep? home and watch yourself back and just go... <laughs> no, never. Oh, that's the worst. Okay. Uh, I like to twiddle it. We'll look at a clip of your performance from earlier on. Here you are. It's Tiffany Page on stage. Thank you. Right. Boy in there. Yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put yourself <laughs> down. No, it's not at all. Big comparisons made to, between you and Chrissy Hind and other such kind of musical legends. How, yeah. how does that make you feel? Is that is that added pressure or is that a nice thing? No, I think it's a nice thing. I, it's good because when people say, how do you describe your music, instead of going, well pop rock you could just go oh pretenders and then oh all right yeah no so now i can imagine how you sound so it's hard but well look tiffany it's been lovely meeting you thanks Thank for hanging you. out on yes, our terrace this evening it's now time for a quick break but don't go anywhere because still to come we've got the foals and florence the machine yes and we'll be joined by martin freeman and ollie moors see you in a moment <laughs> welcome back it's good wasn't it to the eye Martin Freeman, everyone! Martin, Martin um, Boy George there, so you've worked with Boy George. Also, get to that. Are you happy and well? I'm quite well, I'm quite <laughs> yeah. you, Are you having nightmares? Is that why you're not sleeping well? Or... So that I slept until about midday? Yeah. Okay. Turn it on to music, yeah. please. This is a festival. <laughs> um, you're a big soul music fan. Thanks, Dave, what you listen to, or are you branching it's out? It's going to classical music, everything. Folk, everything. All so far, or would you like to? Plan B. Up. Tickets, if you want to come down to that. You can <laughs> put me up. We can get you to formally yeah. invite you yeah. to the gig. Formality, please, Sorry, man. Martin. Yeah. Sorry. I'm not yeah. one of you. Yeah. right. Yeah. We'll, 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 of course, send you More some an invitation. Yeah. And if, if you yeah. can come, that would be great. Yeah. Um, last week. Mm. He's uh, currently in a band. Um, the doing a little festival. Uh, yeah, the Pets. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah. good. Uh, the Thing in Welsh. In bands in the I've past. Troubled, yes, I've troubled. They're a precedent for someone who I would like to... Who's so I thought, well, I'll do the thing that I'm better at. And I'm much better actor than I was ever going to be a musician. Yeah. What did you play or, or do in the band? I played moment? percussion and I, <laughs> I was a young man then. I was that a young person. You could have said hook me up. I would have been hooked up then, but now, you know. <laughs> Sorry, did yes. you have an MC rap name? Did you? Like it's not. It. What were you expecting? A lute? Uh, yeah, a lute. Uh, <laughs> a mandolin. I do love a lute. So <laughs> it's all about you. Um, yeah. Sherlock Holmes series, a modern sort of updated version. So She's playing Sherlock and I'm playing Watson. And it's co-created oh, League co of Gentlemen. League of yeah, Gentlemen fabulous. in general. Something I'm genuinely proud of. I think it's one of the best things I've been in. Did you go and see the kind of Hollywood blockbuster? I did, movie? yeah. Well, we all went to your role, in my role. role. In my <laughs> role. We all went. It was really enjoyable and there was nothing we to see it. Well, How thank you. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm very excited about it. Um, Martin Freeman, everyone. Hello. Yeah. Do you like Florence the Machine? I do actually. It's very handy because <laughs> yeah. it leads us very nicely onto yeah. this. Uh, the festival yeah. wanted to put on something extra special for the fans, and the lucky 100 people who won tickets will not be forgetting this acoustic performance anytime soon. We played one of the tracks from it yesterday, which was gorgeous, and now we're giving you another treat from that gig. Enjoy. Oh. Florence sort of seemed That's genuinely nice, surprised it had gone well at the end. That was very cute. Um, Martin, if you could have an intimate gig, who would it be with? Rocks the other day, I think, and Rocks I really like that. Yeah. 
that and Plan B. Sounds good. Yeah. Um, now, since we are a digital uh, music festival, uh, you can watch the gigs that you didn't manage to bag free tickets to live on our website, itv.com slash itv2. You can also tell us what you think about the performances um, and anything festival related at our Facebook and Twitter pages. Talking of Twitter, of yes, course, Dave. Yes, here we go. We've come up with a game that combines the wonderful world of social networking with all the talent on our bill. It's called Tweet or Lyric. Martin would... Uh, I've always wanted to play this. You're game. here yeah, for yeah. this. The yeah, soul yeah, pubs, yeah, everything yeah. you've done. But we got a quote from one of the uh, bands and artists that appeared on the lineup. So if they tweeted this or it's a lyric from one of their songs. This Florence, who we just saw. Um, OK, this is the quote. Fell asleep, woke up surrounded by hills and white horses. Is that a tweet or a lyric? I think that's a tweet. 27 on May the 21st. Well done. Already beating Jack Osborne's record of none you've out gone of three. Done. National, a band mm -hmm. that you've, you've enjoyed, Mike? Yes, well, I, I'm aware of the festival on Saturday night. Um, can someone send a runner for The Guardian I lost today? You must be somewhere in London. Mm. Well, if that's a lyric, I'll... You're wrong! <laughs> Who's got a hat? Look at that. It's from uh, High Violet, which is I like that. This is from Underworld. Everything in 5D, a cool day at the Lemon, getting loud and jiggy with the Rhythm Crew, prepping this return to the city of dreams. Tweet or lyric? It can only be Underworld. Surely. It does, yeah, yeah. No, my... <laughs> so tweet no. said on July of the night, that would explain. Martin, you did OK. One out of three. Uh, thank you, Martin. Are you going to be sticking around? Now, Martin <laughs> yeah. Freeman, everybody. Yeah. OK, yeah. time for a little break. Don't go anywhere, because we've got a performance from Foles. We've also got Matt Edmondson, uh, testing out his psychic powers on Stornoway, and the X Factor's Ollie Murs will be joining us. See you in a bit. Welcome back. We are live and Fern has got a chronic case of the hiccups. This it's is going to be now. so much fun. I'm all right. Hey, Ollie Murs, right. everyone. Hello. Chatting up the audience for a moment. <laughs> the, the first important question is what crisps, what cheese, how does this... <laughs> Cheesy puffs. Two slices of bread, bang in the middle. But cheese? No, just cheese. When, when I went travelling, that was the only thing. Travis, you're on the sushi. And it's nutritional yeah. as well, kids. Don't forget yeah. that. That can really help you out. Um, now, welcome to the festival, Ollie. Thank How you very much are for having you me. today? Actually, one at the festival so far? Because uh, Plymouth's label buddies with me, so... Yeah. Last year on The X Factor, of course, you came second, which must have been back. And also seeing that JLS didn't win and they've done so, so well, mm. you must be pretty confident about things. Have to win it, though, Ollie. Well, uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's a great... You know, he's a great... I agree. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, and uh, just trying to enjoy as much as I can and... and well, please hear that for you, mate. And what about the album? You said the single's out and about. Yeah. Uh, when Bad Boy Called. How... Cheesy Puff Sandwich. Cheesy that Puff one. Sandwich. Yeah. Oh, great picture on the front of you just in a mink coat. Maybe Again. look as cool as you though, you've got to get around it. I don't know. you worked with Robbie Williams on the X Factor Vice? No, I mean, I've... and that was a real surreal moment. Do you uh, think of the news that's come out today that Robbie and Take That are uh, working together doing an album? Right. But everyone wanted to, well, it's just the. the, the, the... Can't wait As to see them back together. As was I. Every concert. <laughs> um, what about um, what about Simon Cowell? Do you still do, do see him? Is good sign. Touched in, so yeah. it's great. Now, Ollie, this is not your first time in Camden. Quite recently, you were busking. Uh, we here. didn't. Uh, well, we was doing the new single, please don't let me go, and then um, Camden Lock, you were at, weren't you? Camden Lock. That's yeah. how much did you get? I think it was about pounds and <laughs> sixty-two. And you pence. got that by a pound from when I spoke to you in the dressing room. Yeah, yeah I was rubbish. So. Well, look, Ollie, Ollie thank you, darling. Idea. It's been no, lovely thank talking you so to you. Do stick around, Jeff. Uh, now, uh, the third member of our festival family is Matt Edmondson, and he's been very busy this week soaking up the atmosphere and handing out in his TP. He has. Every week he's uh, been inviting one act to join him at his specially created festival stall. This week it was Brian and John from Stornoway, one of the freshest and most talked about acts on the lineup. They're a brilliant band. Their debut album was five years in the making and features over 100 instruments. They're very, very talented chaps. No wonder it took so long. Just get drums and guitar. Why do people do this to themselves? It's mental. He is very psychic. He's brilliant, as always. Good work from Matt. Right, time for a break now before we do a massive thank you to today's guest, Marty Freeman. Oh, oh. Oh. For a quick break, but don't go anywhere because we'll be talking to Amy McDonald fresh from her live performance tonight. But first, a band who performed way back in a distant time called Day Four of the festival. Uh, they're one of my personal favourites. I'd like to share it with you. This is Foles. <laughs> 